today. Today has been super productive so far. I got a lot of work done on the computer this morning. I uploaded a video of speed painting for um, the mermaid painting that I did of a mermaid. I've also gotten some packages ready to ship out to my patrons. I'm going to send those off tomorrow whenever I whenever I go out. I also added a new rewards tier to my Patreon page, so check out the link below and go check that out if you're interested in being a patron. Um, I'm going to start offering real-time uh, live tutorials of my art process in the new tier, as well as bi-monthly uh, 8x10 prints that you'll receive. So if you're interested in something like that, go check it out. Plus all the other rewards from the other two tiers. Still waiting to hear back from my job. I haven't heard anything yet. But I did have something really exciting happen this morning. I had a brilliant idea that I cannot disclose to you just yet. But it's something that I'm really, really excited about. And hopefully once I kind of get the ball rolling with it and everything, um, I can let you know what it is. But it's going to take a lot of time and effort to work on and I'm super excited. But yeah, that's about it. I got some new watercolor paper in that I'm really excited about. I haven't even opened it yet. But I'm about to sit down and work on the coloring page for June's um, color sheet that will go out to my patrons. So that's what I'm about to do. Also, I've been thinking a lot, you guys. Yeah, I've been thinking a lot about this channel and the direction that it's going. And I was beginning to worry that if I put too much of my artwork up there, that people would think that this is an art channel and start to leave because they were here for the witchcraft. Um, but you know, that's kind of, uh, that's what I'm doing right now. And in a lot of ways, that's also a way for me, an outlet for me to explore my spirituality. So I'm going to go ahead and just post what I want to post. I told you guys that's what I'm going to do. It's my channel. And I'm going to post whatever I feel like it. And yeah, I, I, hope that, I hope that you don't mind. And I hope that you will join me in this journey that I'm on right now. Because like I said, for me, um, producing art and creating really is a spiritual uh, exploration, if you would. It's a... It's an, expo an exploration of the soul and I think that rendering a painting and creating a work of art is, it really, I used to feel like, I don't even know how to express how it makes me feel. It makes me feel like I'm, it's a way for me to outwardly express, you know, parts of myself and parts of my inner being and my inner psyche that I'm not fully able to express like verbally or outwardly in other ways. And I'm, I'm such an incredibly like visual person. Um, I learn visually, you know, I find imagery uh, very uh, stimulating in ways and I just you know, I've always enjoyed producing art and it's always been something that's been very dear to me and used to, you know, of course when I was like a young angsty teen, I would tell you that artwork is very much like just, you know, cutting open your heart and letting it bleed out onto a page because that's, you know, that's how much emotion I try to put into my artwork and, you know, sometimes I fail at that and it doesn't really capture a part of me but sometimes it really does and you know those those works of art those are the ones that you know make my life meaningful and um, give me that sense of purpose like I am leaving something behind that others can admire you know for years to come and I guess because I guess because I don't have children and uh, children aren't something that I see in my future. You know, I never really wanted to have kids. You know, these are the creations that I'm leaving behind as part of my legacy. You know, everybody wants to leave behind something to that they can be remembered by. And I think for a lot of people, that's their children. That's, you know, their bloodline. 
But since I don't have that, I think a lot more often about how I'm going to make my mark on this world. And I'm going to do it by literally drawing and painting and, you know, creating works of art that others can admire or that they can hate. You know, I don't mind, even if you look at my work and you're like, oh, I hate that, it's ugly. You know, that's still exciting for me because even if you're repulsed by something that I do, you know, that is still uh, evoking an emotion in you um, that you didn't have before you looked at it. And that's the way that I see art and that's the way that I see the world is that everything that we encounter in our everyday lives, these experiences, you know, are all just memories, they're all just images that live in our head. And certain images can impact your entire life. You know, there are paintings that I've seen that, like I can still recall right now, that have, you know, shaped parts of my life, parts of how I view the world. And for some of you, uh, it may be writing. It may not just be, you know, images. It may be writing. And that's another thing, you know. Um, there are so many different ways to create and you know leave a part of yourself behind or put a part of yourself out there for others to enjoy and to benefit from and this is my way of doing it so I'm not going to apologize to you guys for sharing that part of my life uh, with you and I think that I just needed to I think I need to talk it out with myself, not so much as an explanation to you, but more of an explanation to myself because I was starting to feel a little um, guilty, I guess, for not putting out, uh, I guess, the content that I felt that you deserved. Um, but like I said, this is uh, this is my life and this is what I do, and you know, I I'm glad that you're here. Uh, to encounter it and there will always be witchy uh, videos that are coming up. I'm not saying right now that this is a turning point in my channel or anything like that. That's not what I'm saying. Um, I'm just saying there may not always be a balance in what I do because my life isn't always balanced. I lean really hard into uh, one thing at a time usually with whatever it is I'm doing. I just you know, submerge, like fully submerse myself in whatever it is I'm working on at the time. And those are the parts of me that you will be seeing the most of. So I just wanted, I just wanted to talk about that. I wanted to talk it out and let you guys know what was happening with that. And um, I hope that you understand and I hope that you continue to enjoy uh, the content that I make and that I put out there for you to see. So today is, Thursday. <laughs> Today is Thursday. It's uh, Thursday morning and I woke up with a really bad um, headache, like a tension headache almost and I suffer from migraines so if I'm not careful then my headaches can turn into a migraine and this one actually is kind of starting to come over here to the side of my head but um, I decided to just kind of take it easy today and I also need to wrap up this video a little bit, so I'm gonna have a nice hot, soothing bath this morning to try and relax a little bit, get rid of this headache because I have a lot of work to do today. And I actually have to go to work tonight, so I need to, I really need to get feeling better. So I apologize for my face, but I'm just really kind of groggy and uh, fuzzy right now. But yeah, I got this. I got a nice little bath ran and I got me some crystals and I have some oils over here too that I'm gonna put in it and just soak and relax and enjoy that so I just wanted to uh, thank you guys for coming to this video and uh, I'll see you next time